shit, shit. Oh, Jesus. It started playing before I could do the thing. It said, are we there? Are we in contact? Excellent. Very excellent. We may begin. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. You must create a vessel. Select the head that you prefer. Shit, that's good customization. Oh, fuck. That one's pretty cool. Alright, but before I continue... Hello, what's up, everybody? My name is Default Dude, and today I am playing a little game called Delta Room. Let me just make sure everything's recording correctly. I think the uh, aspect ratio is a bit off. Yeah, it is. I'm going to find a way to fix that in a second. Hi. Um, wow. This is a demo for what appears to be a sequel to Undertale. I am still in shock. Give me a second. I'm going to try and fix the aspect ratio thing. There we go. So let's make that... Alright, that's, that's good enough. I'm going to suit choose this head, which is the button. That's the button. Shit. Alright, so this was announced like a few days ago or something. I don't know. I, I, I think I missed the initial um, announce date. And I, I checked on YouTube and there are a bunch of videos already up and it said, you know, don't tell, uh, don't tell people about this for 24 hours or something. But, you know, fuck that. Uh, I actually don't know how long it's been. Uh, ooh, I do like the jacket. But then again, I do like the sleeveless. No, I'm going to go with the jacket. Go with this one. Alright, so this is just a demo. It's not the, uh, the full release. And as I understand it, these all look the same. Let's just go with the default. As I understand it, um... This is about three hours, three hours long, and is, I mean, the actual thing, uh, the, the window is called Contact for some reason, uh, but the, the program itself is called Survey Program, which I assume means that this is going to be like a, a test for players so that uh, Toby Fox can get, like, uh, responses. You know, it's a survey. Yeah. But I am so eager to play this. I am going to set some alarms. Yes, I accept it. Excellent. You have created a wonderful form. Now, let us shape its mind as your own. What is its favorite food? Pain! Oh, Jesus. Let's go with sweet. I like sweet food. Your favorite blood type is... O is my favorite blood type, actually, but I guess that's fine. Let's go with... A, B. What color does it like most? It likes... Cyan. Please give it a gift. Let's give it the gift of... Bravery. I'm a sucker for bravery. How do you feel about your creation? It will not hear. Oh, Jesus. I love my creation. Have you answered honestly? Yes, I have. You acknowledge the possibility of pain and seizure. Yes, Jesus. Okay, fine. Understood. I'm going to put the other earphone on. Oh, that's another thing. I have no idea what the sound quality is like, because it just jumped straight in. I wasn't given an option to change the... Um, wasn't given an option to change the music volume or anything, so if I'm a little hard to hear, bear with me. I'll do my best to fix it in a second. Name your vessel. Uh, Casper. We called it Casper. Yes, we did. And what about the creator? Write your own name. Let's go with default. Oh, 
I can't be bothered to type dude. Default. Excellent. He likes saying excellent. Truly excellent. There he goes again. Default. That's me. That's my name. Don't wear it out. Thank you. You're welcome. For your time. You're welcome. Your answers. Your wonderful creation will now be discarded. Ah. No one can choose who they are in this world. Your name is... Ah, you motherfucker! Chris. Toriel! Chris, if you do not wake up, we'll be late for school. Oh, this house. This place. I'll wait outside for you, alright? My boy! My beautiful baby boy! I can move! Clothes draw! I I guess these are my pajamas. It's a beautiful day outside. The drawer is mostly empty except for a school cross-country shirt with a tear in it. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious, ska. There's also a game console. It has one normal controller and one knockoff one. Oof. Oh, I love this. Many boxes filled around with old books. Cool. Oh, sweet Jesus. Seen quite a few crashes. Oh, it's good to be back. Oh, it's good to be back. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Look at me smiling like a buffoon. All right. Oh, I'm, oh, this is tough. I sort of want it to be full screen for the sake of looking good. But shit. Hmm. That's a tough one. It looks fine. Shit. Okay. I don't know what setting I just changed, but it looks fine. All right, let's do this. Oh, a cactus. There's not much to say about it. There's always lots to say about cacti. There are many books. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Tales of Snails! Why does that sound familiar? I, I, oh shit, the title has changed to the beginning. The Windows title. Okay, cool. Can snails help your garden? Um, not really. An assigned copy of The History of Humans and Monsters by Gerson Boom. The History of Humans and Monsters. Is that... Is that what it was before? History of Humans and Monsters or just History of Monsters? I don't know. Is this a sequel? Who knows? It was a long faded and there's no green. Domira! It's only you. The door is locked. Okay, can I sprint? Yes, I can. Well, I can fast jog. Stairs! Just saying. Everything is awesome. You looked inside the sink cupboard. There's... A can of Icy's Cool Boys Body Spray, spray for the boys, flaming hot pizza flavor. Seems to be almost entirely full. Oh, excellent. Do I get to keep it? On the shower ledge, there's a small container of apple scented shampoo and a gallon sized container of pet shampoo. That's nice. Okay. It's a trash can. Somehow it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. Well, you know how it is. It's a landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. This chair. It's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. Cheriel? Cheriel. The TV doesn't seem to be plugged in anymore. Well, we don't watch TV in this household. That is unclickable and all. Chris, there you are. You might still be able to make it. Chris, it's a beautiful day today, is it not? I hope it stays this way when Asriel visits next week. Asriel? But I wonder after the excitement of university. Will he still enjoy coming home to this little town? Asriel? <gasps> what the fuck is going on? In just that short 20 second bit, I saw so many things I recognized. teacher so does everyone have a and is that monster kid uh, oh Chris we thought you weren't coming today 
We're doing group projects this month. Uh, so walk around and find a partner, okay? I know exactly. Is that Temmy? Is there a Temmy? And um, the cold dude? Ah, uh, you know it's gotta be my friend Monster Kid. Yo, Chris, show up earlier next time. Ended up having a partner of Snowy. Oh man. He keeps turning to me and saying, Howdy, partner, like a cowboy. Alright, Temmy. Crisp. Alba. Their swords. Tem. Already have partner. Shit. Don't do that again. But I want to find out who you are. It's a black and white hard boiled egg. Sadly, seems like it already has a partner. God dang it. What about you? I don't recognize you. Ah, Chris. Late again, I see. Hmm. You need a partner? Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. Though, wait, Chris, now that I think about it, your unique skill set might help a lot on this assignment. Pfft, not. I actually want to get an A. Yeah, well, you're an ass. Okay, is there any way to change the... Oh, call home. No one picked up. That's fine, I guess. Oh, I want to be cool with the snake, the boy of snake. Chris, you know, Jockington and Caddy are always partners. We're the ultimate academic duo ever since our first gym class. It was hula hoop day and they ran out of hoops for us. So she used me instead. That's our origin story. That's a cool origin story. And you're Catty? Click, click, tap, tap. Taken. I love him already. Hey, Chris, what's up? Did you lose your pencil again? Here. You want the candy cane one or the one with the lights on it? Huh? You want to be partners? Uh, sorry, Birdly already asked me. But I could ask Ms. Alpha so we can make a group of three. I'll ask if you're sure. Yes, ask, please, God, yes. You're the last one. And that in no way reflects my opinion of you. Okay, I'll ask. Ms. Alpha, um, is it okay if we have a group of three? Hey, what? No, I do not approve this. Abort. What? But, but Chris don't have a... Uh, Nello, what were you saying? She was just saying we're fine being alone. Uh, actually, I just wanted to know if... Noel, could you please speak up? My boy, my dude. Uh, oh, my girl, my chick. Uh, hi, Susie. Cool, mysterious. Am I late? Oh, no, you're fine. We were just, uh, choosing partners for the next group project, and, um, Susie, you're with Chris. This is an excellent choice. Great. I love him already. Now that everyone's here, I'll write the assignment. Uh, has anyone seen the chalk? This is the third time it's gone missing, and... You all know I can't start class without some. What a coincidence. How about this? If no one speaks up, everyone gets in trouble. No, that doesn't work. Also, it's technically a war crime. Did you know that? Uh, anyone? Please? Hey, uh, there might be some in the, uh... Might be a box in the supply closet. Miss Alphys, why don't you, uh, Susie and I... Good, good idea, Noel. Susie, since, since you came in last, why don't you go get it for me? Great. Whatever. And slam the door. And Chris, can you go with her and make sure she um actually gets it and um stays out of trouble? Thanks, Chris. See you later. What the fuck is going on? Hi. Susie, you're my new best friend, whether you like it or not. You just eat the chalk? I didn't quite process that process says says that on time. I need oh Jesus, I need to wash this down with some senior peep. I mean, some brandless, non suable drink. Chris? Didn't see you there. Hey. You didn't see anything just now, did you? Hmm. You can't even say? Chris. Hey. Let me tell you a secret. Quiet people piss me off. Oh fuck, I thought that was a Vriska's theme for a second. 
Oh, Jesus Christ, that gave me the weirdest heart palpitation. You think just because you don't say anything, I can't tell exactly what you're thinking? It's over. I caught Susie eating all the chalk. This was her last chance. Now she'll finally be expelled. Ha. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it. Everyone wants it. So congrats, Chris. You got me. I'm done for. Just let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled for just having a snack. So Chris, if I know you're going to pull the trigger, <laughs> why don't I just expel get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel? About losing your face. Anything for my best friend. Nah. Chris, you got a good mother. Be ashamed to make her bury a child. Alright, let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk, mosey back to class, and then, Chris, you'll do our project. How's that sound? Oh, Jesus! Oh, you bitch! <laughs> I didn't even get to click anything. Oh, I didn't even... Oh, I didn't even... I wasn't gonna consider my options. I was just gonna say bad, and she beat me to it. Don't bother answering. If you haven't gotten it by now, your choices don't matter. Ah, you... Bitchsicle. Let's go, freak. You know, I think I'm reconsidering having them as a best friend. Locker is locked. Locker's lock is locked. The locker's locker is locked. The lock's locker is locked. The locker's lock's locker is locked. The locker is covered in Jockington memorabilia. Oh, that's cool. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? At this dance, all the chaperones wear giant hawk heads and screech at any students that make eye contact while dancing. Or that make contact while dancing. Oh, shit, I read it again. Ah, fuck, I read it again. Alright. Yo, what's up? I'm gonna root around for secrets. Chris? What, realize the baby classroom was better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. I've got to find a better partner in there. Nah, actually, let's not. Wrong way, Chris. Shit. Chris, you just gonna skip school? What, am I supposed to snitch on you? That'd be rich, huh? Nah, I wouldn't. Get back here. Well, if you wouldn't, then... Chris, if you skip school, your mum will have a heart attack. You make an excellent point, best friend. I didn't get to read that bit. Nah, I get it. I'm not used to walking around without someone holding your hand. Come on, freak. Oh, wait, yeah, that's right, we're not best friends. God, it's so hard to remember who your best friends are sometimes. Well, here's the closet. Too bad. We were just starting to have fun. We were, weren't we? Are you going to shove me in the closet? Oh, shit, what just happened? I can see your eye. You're not a goth anymore. That's how it works. Hey, Chris, is it me, or is it really dark in there? What's the holdup, Chris? Are you gonna go in, or what? Fuck no. <laughs> Fine, if you're gonna be a wimp, then I'll... You know, I'll just... We'll both go in at the same time, is what'll happen, is what I said will happen to us together. See? Why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. Let's try to find a light switch. I'm no expert, but usually the light switches are... Chris, if you leave me in here, I'll... Shit. How big is this room? Usually the light switch is by the door. It's weird, I can't find the switch. I guess it's further in. Let's go, best friend. Uh, kind of big for a closet, huh? You'd think we'd have reached the end by now. Hey, uh, Chris? I think this closet's, uh, broken. There aren't any walls. Well, we've worked hard enough. Palfus wants to talk so bad she can get it herself. Let's split. It's bigger on the inside. Is this the Doctor Who Undertale crossover we've all been waiting for? What the? Hey, this isn't funny. Let us out. Let us... Huh? The floor, it's... Oh, shit. Don't like that one bit. Oh, and it's gone. Oh, and we're falling. Well, that certainly happened. I look different.
that's the lightest touch. Oh. 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 I've broken the game. Shit. At times you see it flickering. The light only you can see. By second nature you reach out and... Save your game. That's like 24 minutes? I haven't been here for 24 minutes. Oh, hello. Oh, don't like that one bit. Huh, nope, hate that. Oh, Jesus. That's some goop. It's too dark to see anything. Okay, what about this? Nope, still goop. Too dark to see anything. That's cool. And I'm pretty sure I saw something move at the top of the screen just now, but I didn't process it because I was too busy bullshitting. Oh, yeah, you see, there it goes again. Alright, what's this? Oh, Jesus. At least I'm not dead. Boy, do I hate this. No, that's a different way. Alright, fine, let's go this way. <gasps> a thing. There's something glowing inside. Take it? Fuck yes. You got the glow shard. What's the glow shard? Oh, the, the, the HUD changed. That's not the word I was looking for. Its use is unknown. Well, let's find out. No, oh, I can't use it because its use is unknown. Uh, equip? I have a wood blade. Not that I'll ever need it. Wait, does that say carbon reinforced? A wooden practice blade with a carbon reinforced core. Shit. Oh, my brother just texted me, but I have more important things to do. Sorry, Blue. Those look like eyes. Oh, I hate that that's red. Oh, fuck. Oh, shite. Alright. My poor reaction time aside, I think that went pretty well. You bathed your body in the light. A power shines within you, breaking through the darkness. The pain you had melted away pain you had. Oh, the pain you had melted away. God, I'm terrible at enunciation. HP fully restored. Save. Eye puzzle. In this land, only eyes blinded by darkness can see the way. Oh, that's cool. Is it a puzzle? Oh, I love puzzles. I did a good thing. I'm so good at puzzles and smart and special and a good boy. Look at me being so smart and clever. Investigate the bubble pile. I don't like that at all. Oh, shit. Can I climb this? No? Okay. But that's how they got down. Oh, shit. Hey, back off! Come any closer and I'll... Oh, it's... Oh! Why are we dressed like, um, fantasy RPG characters? Chris? Phew. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass. Unless you want to get clocked in the face. <laughs> anyway, enough screwing around. Gonna find a way out of here. Susie, that's her name. Where is here, anyway? Doesn't matter, you got us into this mess, you get us out. Okay. Lead the way, Chris. Nice. I got a party member. Oh my god, never mind, you walk way too slow. Okay, there she goes. It was nice having a friend for a little while. Oh, dynamic backgrounds. Hey, Chris, something up here waving at us. Any idea what they want? Whoa, those are spades. Run, Chris! Dun dun. Dun dun. Oh shit. It's just like that one time. That was easy. I'm so good at video games. Chris, down here. Don't have to tell me twice. Oh shit. Oh, I hate this. Circles are my friend. I'd feel pretty stupid if I was the guy making those things. Can't hit shit. Oh, 
though this place is dope as fuck. Oh, you're not dead. Sweet. Got any idea what the heck this place is? <sighs> Me neither. I wonder if there's anyone in that building up there. Let's find out. This place is creepy as hell. Looks like a shop with the doors locked. No one's inside. What about this one? It's locked. But what about this one? It's locked. And what about this one? It's locked. Well... In front of you, a castle looms beneath the empty town. A black geezer emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. Save game. Castle Town. What is this, Kingdom Hearts? That's not a place in Kingdom Hearts, I realize. A castle. Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? Welcome, heroes. Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please, come forward, both of you. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness. Chris, Susie, there is a legend in this land. A legend that one day, two heroes of light will arrive and fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. Listen. Very well, then. Once upon a time, a legend was... No, I'm not going to do that. A legend was listed among the shadows. It was a legend of hope, a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light, it was a legend of dark. This is the legend of Deltarune. For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance. That's the shape of the dude who waved at me. Bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror. And the land will crack with fear. Then, her heart pounding, the earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear at World's Edge. A human, a monster, and a prince from the dark. That's us. Only they can seal the fountains and banish the angels' heaven. Only then will balance be restored, and the world saved from destruction. Today, the Fountain of Darkness, the geezer that gives this land form, stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. And with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believe you two are the heroes of legend. And despite whatever enemies you may face, you two have the courage to save the world. Delta Warriors. Please, won't you accept your destiny? Uh, nah. What? Me? Some kind of hero or something? You got the wrong person. B but, Susie, without you, the, the, the world will... So what if the world gets destroyed? It's none of my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. Anyway, Chris, if you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to find a way out of here. Susie, wait. Oh, that sounded way too much like Flowey. It made me shit myself. <laughs> Heroes were already running away. They didn't even know I was here. Dad's gonna make me son of the month. Who the hell are you? I'm... Two-dimensional. The bad guy. 
You clowns want to steal our uh, seal our dark fountain, huh? <laughs> and still picturing you guys as clowns. Save the world from eternal darkness, huh? Eh. Don't try to deny it. We both know you'll go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you go there. And I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it. Step one, I thrash you. Step two, you lose. Huh. <laughs> nice plan, kid. Really? Yeah, actually. Mind if we use it on you instead? Dun dun. Oh shit. Lancer busts in. Hannibal busting in. Alright. Let the fight begin. Pacifist route. Check. He's at a hack of seven, a defensive one. Not to call a spade a spade, but he's a spade. Not an old, old enough to ride a motorcycle, so he sets his bike on fire. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Halt, clowns. This bike is fueled by victory. Alright, let's rock. Pedal to the metal. Well, that didn't work. Don't know how I, uh, don't know how I got an axe, but, like, that's cool. Lancer. Warning. Tell Lancer to watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. God, I'm an asshole. I love to get thrashed. Oh, yep, that's exactly what he said. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm so bad at this. What is that little... Ch ch Lancer is thinking about chips. That's nice. Use the glow shard. Nothing happened. I don't know what I expected. So, what are you guys doing after this? Let's find out. Ah, fuck. That was easy. I'm gonna compliment you so bad. Tell Lancer you can't tell between his clothes and his body. He seems flattered. His attack power went down. Damn straight it did. Susie, get him. You make my feelings do wheelies. Sweet wheelies. Oh, narrowly dodging gives me TP, whatever that is. Alright. Wait, wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. Alright, you punkaroos. You had the luck of the draw this time, but next time, the losers will be you. <laughs> Bye, losers. Gonna get home before dinner. See you later, Bowser Jr. You got zero XP and 37 dollars. Are you two okay? Um, let me to introduce myself more properly. I am... Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Uh, um, uh, alright, all yep. Hello everyone. I am, uh, Ralse. Chris, Susie. It's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm certain we're going to become great friends, and I feel like I should dish this voice now that the hood is gone. Best way to leave is east, right? Y yeah, that that's where we'll... Got it. See you at school, Chris. Um, I suppose it's just the two of us, then. Chris, I'm, I'm Prince, but I am... Currently don't have any subjects, so I've been waiting here alone and my whole life for you two to arrive so i'm i'm really happy to meet you hope we can be good friends chris me too i've forgotten your name already let's try to find Susie. she must be to the southeast you can lead the way chris cool first i'm gonna break into your house hey chris i really think we should catch up with Susie. we can come back here after our adventure is over then i can bake you a yummy cake oh what a good friend ralse that's their name I knew that, of course. Alright. Ralse, the lonely prince, is now your ally. The power of fluffy boys shines within you. That's a good power to have. Okay. I'm gonna end this video here. Uh, because I want to stick to a schedule with these. So, thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, click the like button down below. Or leave a comment if you want to tell me how bad I am at playing video games. Subscribe to my channel for more of this quality content in the future. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.